Canyon Lake. It's Erin Woods, your children's ministry coordinator, and I wish I could reach through the screen and see you right now and give you a big hug and a can. And unfortunately, I also brought a really big bag of candy with me today. Ooh, do you love candy? My favorite type of candy is these Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, my favorite. My husband's favorite is Twizzlers. Uh, my son Taylor loves Kit Kats. And I think Joe would take pretty much anything in the bag too. But this bag of candy has 110 pieces. There's no way that I'm gonna eat this 110 pieces all by myself, right? So I think that I would love to share it with people. Maybe I can find some neighbors or friends to share it with. That would be pretty great, wouldn't it? That's the thing. If you make some goodies like cookies or bread this time of year, it's always so much fun to share those goodies and treats. I also love to share when I have like really exciting news. Do you love to share when you have exciting news? Like, for example, maybe you lost a tooth and you just can't wait to tell everybody that you lost that tooth, right? Or maybe you got a good score on a test or read a really good book. Maybe you watched a really good movie. There are so many things that are super fun to share. But one thing we should never forget to share is how much we love God and all of the wonderful things that God does for us. Is that something you think about sharing? Sometimes we don't always think about sharing that. It's so easy to share about teeth and movies and share candy, but we don't always think that we should share about God, but we should. Pretty soon we're going to have our children's Christmas program, that's December 12th, and we are so excited to share that with you. And that is one way that we can share the story of Christmas and Jesus' birth with you. This would also be a wonderful time, I think, to share that with friends and neighbors. We're inviting some friends down the street to see our Christmas program so that we can share that message with them. Can you think of times when you would like to share with other people? Maybe you want to share Sunday school with them, and so you invite them to come to Sunday school because it's so much fun. Or Wednesday night when sardines is happening and you can't wait to share that with others. It's a great way to share God's message. So I guess I just don't want you to ever forget. I mean, we're always constantly telling you to share. Share your toys, share your food, share your candy. But it's just as, if not more important, that you share God's love with everyone too and, and God's story. So that is your challenge this week. Go out and share. I hope you have a good one.